what's good everybody it's your boy lg and i'm back with another video guys and today i have the 9060 again yes again this is probably like my third video guys these should not be slept on they are sitting right now at snipes if you if you're curious go check out your local snipes go online i know they have like sizes from like i think like 9 to 12 still sitting so if that's your shoe size go check them out because this cherry blossom colorway is super dope, y'all. These are nice. So let's go ahead and jump straight into it. As you can see, we have several cuts of suede in the cherry blossom colorway. Laces, super nice, premium, cherry blossom again. You have this mesh material in like a light pink colorway. Um, and it goes through the outer of the shoe as well as, and I'm going to show you, on the inner of the shoe, it's like a light cream colorway so there's two different colors of mesh it's very subtle but very nice at the same time all right you got this burgundy colorway stitched throughout the shoe even the suede you can see as it makes a transition into the the burgundy and the suede cuts again you have um this 3m material which is all through the gray cuts and it reflects at night which is nice you know most most new balances or people who wear new balances tend to of course go walking running in them and for the comfortability that you get i understand why man these are super comfortable if you have a thin foot wide foot i have a wide foot and again personally i think these ooh, are nice so go ahead and looking at the bottom of the shoe here you do get these weird looking panels and I will say, guys, again, if this is your first time checking me out, I spoke on this before, but these panels do feel a little funky. As you can see, there's some space in between them. They do look a little odd. And again, as you're walking at first in these, you can feel them, but I promise you, you get used to them real quick. So um, outside of that, you do get two sets of laces with this particular pair. The Arctic Gray didn't come with extra set of laces, but this one did. So you get this cream colorway. And then of course the original Cherry Blossom. I did take the time to give you a nice lace swap there. So if you're curious about what that might look like, I went ahead and stitched it about halfway up. I did want to give you some shots of the tongue, which is really nice. Nice thick padding. Again, you get this really nice cut of Cherry Blossom suede. This is some kind of synthetic uh, leather, I'm assuming. I'm not sure what to make it out as, but it's, um, again, these burgundy cuts to help match the suede on the side. And then, of course, you can see it right here on the toe box. Again, you got this plastic tab going with the New Balance 9060. And, yeah, guys, not too much to say. Like I said, there's a few different cuts of that 3M in the gray this this back heel i don't know this plastic tab it's all you know just for visual effects there's no real significance to it just makes a shoe pop look really nice i think in my opinion and then you have the absorb tech which um again is a really nice um i think you know midsole as far as again comfortability because these missiles, whatever they're using, actually on the site, they refer to the Absorb Tech as a superior blend of cushioning foam and compression of rubber. So whatever they're doing, keep it up because, like I said, these are nice. So, you know, the, the midsole there is in the cream colorway. And then, again, you get that burgundy panels on the, the outer sole there. The sock liner, I'm not the hugest fan of. I've never really been a huge fan of the white sock lining. Um, it is really nice, again, <clears throat> as far as the touch of it. Good padding. But, you know, with sock, white sock liner, it tends to get dirty quick. Um, I Like I said, it's not, a, it's not a miss for me. I think if it was in the cream colorway, it would have been nice. Uh, even the burgundy colorway. Maybe the burgundy might have been too much. I don't know, you guys. Let me know your thoughts and opinion what they could have did with the sock liner. I, I mean, that was probably the one thing that I would change with this particular shoe is having a, a white sock liner. I don't know why I'm struggling with that. White sock liner. So, yeah, guys. You know, while you're at it, leave in the comment. You know, you might as well hit that, you know, that thumbs up. Give your boy a like. I'm trying to give you guys some nice quality shots of the shoe before you, 
you know, go out there and purchase them. Or if you're buying online, you know, sometimes there's a there's a gamble with how shoes look online versus in hand. So these, I think, are definitely a hit. You know, if you're taking your chances with buying the 9060s, you won't regret it, in my opinion. For 160 is the retail price. Um, $10 with shipping and handling, depending on who you go through, you know, at the most, I'd imagine. Um, again, not bad numbers for the several different quality cuts of suede. Again, you got the mesh, the cotton, two sets of laces. Yo, like I said, the comfortability is A1. So, yeah, overall, guys, I personally like the shoe, you know. <clears throat> If you don't know, you won't know. So go out there, check out your local snipes. Maybe if there's a local New Balance in your area, they might have them sitting. So, hey, give them a chance. With that being said, guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video. Again, please, for me, give this video a like, a thumbs up, subscribe, because I'm coming back with more content, guys. And, again, I'm giving you the nice close-ups. I'm giving you those A1 lighting shots, giving you that true color I feel in hand. You know, a lot of people be using them lights and be throwing off, I think, the true color of the shoe. But, you know, I'm just using natural light, and this is what you see is what you get. So, yeah, guys, I hope you appreciate this video. Again, it's your boy LG signing out. Peace.